Jeffrey Dean Morgan has once again expressed interest in playing DC Comics' alien mercenary Lobo. The veteran actor could most recently be seen playing the murderous Negan on The Walking Dead but has a long list of credits to his name across both TV and film this year as well as starring on the small screen as Sam and Dean Winchester's ill-fated absentee father in Supernatural. He also appeared in Zack Snyder's Watchmen and alongside Dwayne Johnson in this year's Rampage. Lobo, meanwhile, was created in the 1980s as a parody of such characters as the Punisher and Wolverine. But, ultimately, soared in popularity as a ruthless interstellar bounty hunter, known for his strict code of finishing a job no matter what the cost. The hulking villain and anti-hero has tussled with everybody from Superman to Deathstroke. The character will make its first on-screen appearance on the second season of Sci-Fi's Krypton. Attempts have been made to adapt Lobo for the big screen also. But, as of yet, nothing has come to fruition. While the Lobo movie is still undergoing rewrites, if it ever does move into the pre-production stage, it looks like they may already have someone willing to play the part. Related, Krypton showrunner explains why Lobo is coming in Season 2 speaking at a Walker Stalker Con panel. Via comic book, Jeffrey Dean Morgan was asked about which Marvel character he would be interested in playing. Morgan was a little more apprehensive, believing that the greatest Marvel characters have already been taken. After briefly considering Reed Richards of the Fantastic Four, he switched his attention to the other side of the aisle. Quote, The only one I want to play is DC and Lobo. He's badass. This wouldn't be the first time the actor has revealed his desire to play the character. He first broached the idea all the way back in 2009, when Guy Ritchie was reportedly set to bring the character to life. At that time, he was an early proponent of comic book adaptations, believing them to be untapped worlds. He doubted whether he had the stature to play the role, however, but that they could work around it by transplanting his head onto Mickey Rourke's body. Whether or not Morgan will ever to get his wish remains to be seen, and whether he's right for the role is equally up for passionate debate. There is little denying, however, that he would make for an interesting choice. After all, he already established his cigar-chomping abilities in the aforementioned Watchmen adaptation. He has equally delivered on portraying larger-than-life, foul-mouthed, ruthless, yet likable characters of which Lobo is a front-runner. That leaves his age and physique as the main potential factors working against his casting as well as the fact that he's already played Thomas Wayne in Batman v Superman. Dawn of Justice, though Mickey Rourke will likely be unwilling to lend his services, even digitally, to another comic book movie after Iron Man 2. Using digital trickery to de-age and modify actors is all the rage right now. As such, it would be possible to give the actor the requisite appearance to match the persona he could know. Dat Deliver and with his potential reprisal of Thomas Wayne looking doubtful, due to Zack Snyder's departure and the Flash movie rumored to be moving away from a Flashpoint storyline, this could be a perfect way to keep Morgan within the DCEU fold. Source. Comic Book Tags. Lobo.